My name is Ernest Sim. I am the CTO of Grain. We're working on the smartest restaurant, making great food accessible to everyone. I guess, strictly speaking, I do. I have been programming since maybe 14, 15, but nothing serious. I, the first time I actually learned how to program was to learn how to read code of a private server for a game that I was playing for. I was like, I wanted to make a, some changes on the private server, so I just picked up and learned what's uh, Visual Basic and a bit of like a ball and uh, C++ and stuff like that. So that's the first time I actually got introduced to programming. And I did study it in my polytechnic, but um, yeah, that's probably where I really started to learn by myself. Well, because it's problem solving. In my opinion, programming is an expression of what you know or, or what you think. So programming always comes in languages, right? And I feel like language in, in the original form is how we express and how we speak. So understanding programming is just expressing your thoughts and expressing your, 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 the way you want to solve something. Programming for me is important. Uh, important and I like it is because it's, it's a way of expression. It's like, you come and think of it, it's like art, right? You create something, uh, you could copy and paste it for sure, but like, uh, you could express how you want to solve a problem or not, it, may, it may not even be a problem, it can just be something fun. Yeah, so it's expression for me. It's fun. Uh, I, learned, I learned Java in school, I learned C in school. But honestly, at that point of time, I was more interested in web technologies. So I learned PHP myself, and that was probably where I got my interest in actual programming. Web was a lot easier. I think like generally, when I first started out, I couldn't understand how pointers and stuff would benefit me into creating stuff, right? I think on hindsight, it's definitely important. But for me, what really intrigued me back then was the, the, eff the effortlessness and the ease of creating a web application. That was really my starting point. I mean, it's easy to not use math at the beginning because there's a lot of things that you could do without math. But increasingly, as you start delving into deeper problems to solve, I think math and academia actually starts to rise out as an important thing that we had. I mean, recently we had to calculate drawing of our own, some of our own logos and symbols from SVG, and then we had to like calculate with trigonometry and stuff. I was like, wow, never knew that school would come back here again. Pick it up as a, passion, a hobby first and see whether you enjoy programming in general. I think it's often easy to find that, oh, programming is a lucrative career and then you start to want to do it because it makes money. And that might work out if you start enjoying programming later on. But um, I would generally prefer you to enjoy programming for what it is and then start a career behind it.